At 5 o'clock, Detroit police officers responding to a shooting, and they were heartbroken when they found three little girls, ages 1, 4, and 5, hungry and alone. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig has the details on what brought police to that home. These are the three little girls Detroit police found home alone, left by their mother after there was a shooting in their home. You know, being a parent, I, I, it's just hard to fathom somebody would actually leave their kids in a home after a shooting had occurred. I'm, I'm, I'm just lost for words. I just, I just don't understand it. Here at this house on Ardmore on Detroit's west side is where the family drama unfolded this afternoon. Detroit police sources say it began when the mother's boyfriend argued with her two teenage sons about who was more important to the family. During that argument is when one of the teenagers allegedly used a rifle to shoot the mother's boyfriend in the hand. Both teens took off running and their mom allegedly left their three little sisters behind to drive her boyfriend to the hospital. Found initially were the children children that were left here alone and that was alarming in itself and then we found a crime scene of course and that was also alarming and then there were some other things in the house that led us to believe that child protective services should be notified sources tell action news the house was in horrible condition only one bed one sofa a chair and no food officers made arrangements to have food brought to the children their mom now facing possible charges of child endangerment and at least one or both of her teenage sons also in trouble for the shooting that set all of this in motion um, we have uh, good leads on the persons and or persons involved in this and their arrest is imminent and we're told the little girls will likely be placed with grandma very, very pleasant little girls. I mean, you know, they make your heart melt. On Detroit's west side, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.